Hello Sheffield United fans, welcome to the channel, here you are updated with the latest news, so leave a like and subscribe to the channel to not miss the next news from Sheffield United. Sheffield United are keeping their options open when it comes to seeing Tommy Doyle return to the club this summer. Doyle played a key role last season as United won promotion back to the Premier League and reached the semi-final of the FA Cup v Manchester City. Doyle's stunning winner v Blackburn Rovers cemented his place as part of last season's legacy and most Blades fans want to see the midfielder come back. However, as it stands, United are being priced out of bringing Doyle back. According to Alan Nixon, Doyle would love to return to Bramall Lane and continue where he left off last term. But according to Nixon, United do not currently have the money to buy Doyle. As it stands, any move would likely be another loan and with United only allowed two from the Premier League, it's a decision Paul Heckingbottom is mulling over. United are also keen on bringing James McCatty back to Bramall Lane. However, the talented youngster is part of Pep Guardiola's pre-season plans this summer and could well find himself involved next term. The Blades, then, face a patient wait until closer to the end of the window when it comes to both Doyle and McCatty. Doyle is also said to be wanted by Wolves, though the midfielder apparently has reservations on that move. There's a lot to like about Tommy Doyle. He's a talented midfielder with a big future and very much fits into how Sheffield United operate and play. He is ideal for Ollie Norwood in terms of a replacement and the club will struggle to find many better in terms of a Norwood replacement in the future. However, if the money isn't there then that's just how it is. There will be others out there for United to look at signing and while Doyle would be great, we can move on quickly. In an ideal world, Tommy Doyle returns. But City demand big money for their young players and right now, United just don't have it. Sheffield United fans, put your opinion in the comments. Anytime I come back and bring more news from Sheffield United.